Hello guys, how are you? Uh, I don't want this on the URL. I want just the box or box dot something like the website. I don't want to type public each time. So what we're we going to do, we're going to set up the virtual host on this one. So to do that, what we need to do, we need to go into the application folder again and then the XAMPP. Then here we have etc folder and inside the etc we have extra. Now we need to edit a file in here and this file is vhost file. So we need to open it with any code editor you have. So just gonna open it up. Okay, this is the file here. So we need to copy this, paste this here. Now make sure you watch it carefully and uh, there's a, I'm going to leave a link into the description about this how to set a virtual host so you can check that as well if you face any trouble doing this. So plus we need the document root, we do not need server admin, we can remove this. And uh, here what are we are going to say application exam and then we are going to say h2 docs that's it. And uh, second is server uh, name, it's going to be localhost. Alright, so we have HD docs at place localhost. Now I don't need these two. We can take them off. I'm gonna copy the same and paste it here. And this time document root uh, going to be stdocs slash our project name which is box slash public that's it's going to be and uh, then we have server name what we need to put there I say uh, when I put in URL box.test it should load my page so that's uh, what I want so that's going to be the server name so here just below this we're gonna say directory then we're going to say slash applications slash zamp slash hdocs and we're going to close it. Now here I'm going to close this directory. Now in between these directory we need to put something. So here we say uh, options. Should be O oh, should be capital here. Options. Dex. Dexes. Then we need to put uh, follow. Same links. Okay. And then includes EXEC and then CGI, which is going to be capital. And then we say here allow override all capital A, allow capital O over ride space capital A or just the or and then we say require all granted so capital R require all and that is granted okay and our directory is closed and the virtual host is closed so all looks good so far here and uh, yeah that's it you need to save this file and you can see that's the file is saved once this is done what we need to go, do is we need to go to our dashboard uh, desktop what do we call the main screen and go click and go and go to folder and there we need to type slash private hit go 
it will open this folder, EDC folder, and look for the file hosts. So we have the file hosts here, open the same way, the way we used here. Now we're going to add, uh, you can see I already added here the box.test, similarly uh, like here, it's a box.test. So you, you just need to do the same. You just need to add this 127.0.0.1 space then localhost and then 127.0.0.1 space box.test. Both files should be saved. And uh, once both files are bad, well, what we need to do, we need to uncomment our code, a line of code, which is going to enable this box.test to work. To do that, we need to go into our directory and where we have our project in XAMPP. And in XAMPP, we need to go into the XAMPP files. Inside the XAMPP files, we will be going etc. It's here. And then we need to find the file that is uh, here httpd.config. So just open it the way we open the with the code editor. Now we need to search for uh, one thing that is v host. Oh, sorry, it's host v host dot com. Okay, we have no reason. V host dot com. Then I hit enter. When you search this, you comment this, and you can see that this line of code is commented. We need to uncomment this, and we need to save this file. So it's a virtual host enabler. We are just enabling it here. We need to restart our XAMPP again this time. So stop all. And start up. All right, so it's up and running. Now go into the URL in this dashboard and hit enter. And we have our Laravel. You can see that box not test and we have Laravel working. From the next video, we will going to start editing this and going to make it work. If you like the video, do subscribe and do like the video. Uh, have a nice day. Goodbye.